It's an Amazon Prime unboxing and I picked up some really cool items and had them shipped here to Belize all the way from the States. I've got some beauty items, some electronics, and there's a lot of it. So let's go. everyone welcome to my channel my name is Adrian Kieser and I'm your over 50s fashion diva here on my channel I like to cover everything from fashion beauty lifestyle and travel and anything trending in social media and any of those topics so if you want to stay relevant over 50 you've come to the right place we're gonna get started with me telling you a little bit about getting my items. I picked them up at the Port of Belize today and they're pretty gross. Some of them have bird poop on them, so you know, I'm not wearing anything fancy in this video because it's definitely gonna get messed up as I do this unboxing. I do have quite a few boxes to get through. I did have to open them at the port, so they're, they are open, but trust me, none of the items have been open, and I'm really excited to dive into this first box. I'm gonna start with the littlest box. I'm filming here in my studio, which is a smaller area, so some of these items are gonna be a bit of a challenge to get on camera, but I'm gonna do my best. All right, so the first item that I got is two boxes of Garnier Nutrice. Now, the one thing that I have found very challenging to find here in Belize is platinum blonde color. So I had to order it in from Amazon. So I was on Amazon and I don't remember if it was because of a sale or what the situation was. I just think I wanted some items. And so the Garnier I've used before and I love it. It's a really good um, hair color. It does get my color up to almost platinum. Yeah, that's the reason why I purchased it through Amazon is because it's very difficult to find here in Belize. So this is the Garnier Nutrice Ultra Color Advanced Lightning Cream with Nourishing Anti-Brass Conditioner. And this is in the lightest platinum and the shade is Coconut PL1. And like I said, I got two boxes of that. So that was box number one. Moving on to the next box. The next item is a bit personal, but I'm gonna tell the story anyway. We live here in the tropics and I do have a really great apartment. I love our apartment. I will say that the challenge is cockroaches. No matter how much I clean my place and put things away, we still get cockroaches. It's a thing. Um, I've been looking in the stores for weeks trying to find something to deal with these cockroaches. So I was like, look, I'm ordering things on Amazon. Let me just go ahead and buy something. And so I bought a huge pack of these roach traps, I believe that they are. So this is the Hoi Hoi Trapper Roach Pesticide Free, Safe and Easy. There's five traps in each box. This is what they look like. And I got four boxes of them. <laughs> I'm gonna be putting them all around my kitchen because these aren't just like small little roaches that you get in the States. These are like big honking tropical size cockroaches and I just can't. I just can't do it anymore. I'm just tired of waking up in the middle of the night to get some water and there's a stinking cockroach in my kitchen. So that's why I got this particular item. <laughs> so on to the next one. Some items I absolutely needed, but most of these items are just fun. <laughs> this was an item that I absolutely needed because I am filming on my new camera. I believe that you guys have probably heard that in some past videos, but when I got my camera, it was supposed to come with an extra SD card and the one that it came with didn't fit the camera. So I had to buy a new SD card. So I went ahead and ordered one from Amazon. This is the one that I got here. So the SD card that I got is the Standisk 
Extreme Pro SDXC USC I card. There's 256 gigs. It's in 4K. So I picked up a new SD card. Now this item was a TikTok made me buy it. <laughs> you know, I love TikTok and I'm on there all the time. If you didn't see, um, I purchased an unbrush and I did an unboxing on that and I did a TikTok video showing me using my unbrush and I had mentioned that I did not purchase it through the TikTok shop because I do live here in Belize and I don't want any scams. <laughs> so same situation where I saw this item on TikTok and I was like, oh, I really want that. And so I was like, let me see if I can find something similar on Amazon, and I did. <laughs> this is what it looks like. This is the Lee Bean YMG818 electric cleaning brush. It's efficient, effortless, easy cleaning, used continuously for 120 minutes. You know, it's one of those brush systems for cleaning your bathroom and walls and all these different kinds of things and gadgets. I will definitely have to do a separate video to let you know how it goes. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited for it because I do have two bathrooms in my apartment, but my son and I actually share the shower in his bathroom because I use mine for storage. <laughs> Um, but you know, having to clean a shower that's all tile and the bottom, the floor tiles are really those really tiny tiles that, you know, just feel like they never get quite clean. So I really wanted to buy one of these little brush systems. So I'm really excited to try it. And yes, TikTok did make me buy it. I'm sure you guys, if you haven't seen any of those TikTok videos, I'll try to either insert a video showing off the product and what it does. Um, so that you can kind of get an idea. But I'm really excited to give it a try. And like I said, I will do a separate video to let you know how it goes. Now I'm gonna go back to beauty items. I picked up some goodies that I'm really excited about. And I'm trying to figure out in which order I want to show them because they're all pretty exciting. And you know, I like to save the really fun stuff to the end of the video. Okay, let's start with this item. If you haven't seen any of my live videos, I have a few live videos where I did some jewelry cleaning. And I, of course, I will link those in the description box below. So make sure you check those out. And I have a lot of jewelry. I am a fashion stylist. You know, I have a lot of jewelry in my collection and it's really complicated to sort of get cleaning cloths to clean as much jewelry as I have. So I got an electronic jewelry cleaner. This is the Magnasonic Digital Ultrasonic Jewelry and Eyeglass Cleaner. And this is what it looks like. Let's unbox it. I feel like I haven't unboxed nearly enough items. Let's unbox this guy and see what all is in here. And this is the way it came. It comes with a little instruction manual. And it's much smaller than I thought. I'm sure that it has telescoping rods to it, so. Oh, yeah, man, this wand is heavy. It's got some substantial weight to it. And I guess this is like the main component. Oh, goodness, and then you just like pop this open and then like here's all the little different heads and stuff. So you've got like one of these little buffering heads. You've got like a big spongy head. You've got like a little soft velvety head. Oh, I think this is probably what those pads stick to because it's really rough. So this probably attaches in here. Oh yeah. And then you put all the little heads on it. Oh, and then, oh, it's got like this like really harsh scrubber pad. Lots of brushes. It's got this little brush here that looks like this. It's got a little cone brush to get into the corners. It's got this little flat one. It got a little bit dinged in though. That's kind of annoying, but. Oh, well, oh, it's got this like wound ball type. Really super cool. Oh, and this little nubby guy, it was supposed to be like a cone all the way, but I guess in shipping, this sort of got squished in these bristles here. I don't really know if that's going to affect it or not. 
because really what you're trying to do is get into the corners. So we'll see how it goes. And the same with this one, how it got dented in a little bit on the side. And I'm sure it has all the instructions of we, which each of these little heads does. And then it has all the telescoping parts to, I guess, you know, put the handle together. And then I guess you put it like this. It's long, it's, it's, it's really long. And then there's also a USB, cause like I said, it has up to what, 120 minutes of use time before you have to recharge it. So that's like two hours for you to clean your bathroom. That's pretty amazing. All right, so let me go ahead and put this all away, you know, kind of clean up a little bit and then we'll get on to the next item. All right, let's unbox the jewelry cleaner. Now, if you haven't seen any of my more recent videos, you know I've got a neighbor who keeps their little puppy chained up outside all day and night. So you're gonna hear barking in this video. I apologize. I do have the windows open because that's how we cool our apartment. But you know, there's really not a lot I can do about it. So I apologize if you hear it in the background. But let's move on. Um, you get the instructions. And this is what the unit looks like. Comes with the plug-in cord. Yeah, so it's not cordless, basically. So you do have to be near a power source for it. And it does have the little basket that comes out for you to put your jewelry in. Now this is also says that it's for jewelry, for watches, for eyeglasses, which is a, one of the main reasons that I wanted it is to clean my eyeglasses. And this is what the inside looks like. Really cool Magnasonic. I will have to do a separate video to let you know how it goes. I'm really excited because, you know, having to clean my glasses every day is kind of a pain in the butt. So to be able to just pop them into the machine, have them cleaned in a few minutes to start my day, it, you know, as I'm like doing my skincare routine or whatever, perfect, right? So there we have it, the Magnasonic jewelry eyeglass cleaner. <laughs> of course, I'm putting all the descriptions up on screen for you. Now, we are ready to get into some beauty products. I think I'm gonna start with some skincare. Let's go. TikTok did not make me buy it, but every other influencer, beauty influencer on YouTube did. <laughs> I could not resist what I kept seeing everyone talking about these items. And so I had to have them myself so that I, as a makeup artist, could also give them a try. I got it, the Course RX. I got both items. I'm so excited. The first item, this is the Cos RX. This is the Advanced Snail 92 All-in-One Cream. 100 grams of product in here, and it is 92% snail mucin. I'm really excited to give this a try. I've heard everybody raving about this and how much they love it. So I'm really excited to try it. It says formulated with 92% snail secretion filtrated mucin. This cream helps naturally create the appealing glow of healthy skin. So super excited, let's open it up. So it says, apply to face at least twice daily or as needed to soothe, dry, uncomfortable skin. Woo, -hoo -hoo -hoo. exciting. If you haven't seen it, this is what the snail mucin looks like. This is the container. It does come in a plastic container. And as I said, it has 100 grams of product 3.52 fluid ounces. There she is. So I will definitely be doing a separate video because I'll be adding this to my skincare routine. Unfortunately, I just did a nighttime, new nighttime skincare routine, but neither here nor there. I will be incorporating this product. I'm so excited to get my hands on it. Next is the other Casa Rex. This is the Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence. And it says, being 96 snail secretion filtrated mucin, this essence 
helps the skin to lose less moist while keeping the skin smooth and healthy. Okay, no idea what that is. And then of course you guys know that this is a Korean skincare brand. After cleansing and toning, apply a small amount on your entire face, gently pat using fingertips to aid absorption, and then go forth with your moisturizers. All right, so pre-moisturizer. I'm assuming that would be before retinol, after retinol, we'll figure it out. Again, I'll have to do a separate video incorporating these two new items into my skincare routine. I'm so excited. Finally got them here to Belize, Casa Rex, Casa Rex. <laughs> Next up is this box. I have no idea what's in it. So we're gonna unbox it together. Now, this isn't gonna make much sense, but sort of. There's a bunch of little hangers in here, but these are made for a very specific reason. Wow. All right. These are actually... Oh, look how fun! Now you're like, Adrian, what is that? All right, take a look. These are wig storage containers. Aren't they cool? You unzip, unzip them. All right, so you unzip the pouch and then you can put the hanger in here. You know, you clip your wig in. Clip your wig into the hanger and store them like that. So then you have your wigs all hung beautifully no matter the length as you can see these are really long so they could go for some really long wigs they have like this um i i don't know what you want to call it it's not quite canvas but it's like you know sort of a breathable material so that you know your wigs do have some air to breathe and then the front is plastic and it does have a really good zip there are 12, I believe, hangers that come in the set. And also 12 different bags in different colors. You know, you got your pink, the purple, and the black. And they're all the same white. So that's 12 wig bags. And I needed them, definitely. So that was that item. That's a good one, right? That's a good beauty item. That is a must have. That is a must have if you are a wig wearer. You need to have some way to store your wigs. And I think that that is just the perfect way to do it so that they are hanging. Um, they're still able to breathe, and, but you're able to keep the dust and everything off of them. So I absolutely love that. Absolute win. Now, why have all those wig bags if I don't have wigs to fill them, right? So I picked up some Amazon wigs. Now I've seen a lot of influence say that the Amazon wigs are kind of hit or miss. I think I did some pretty good research when I was trying to pick out my wigs, looking at all the reviews. So I think I got some pretty good ones. So let's open this one up first. Let's see. This is Lothia Glueless Wigs Human Hair Pre-Plucked Pre-Cut Six thirteen lace front wig, human hair, and it just comes in a pack like this. Nothing glamorous or special. And this is just another plastic bag. Nothing exciting. Let's see if it comes with anything exciting in it. Comes with a wig cap. But that's it. Nothing else. This is what it's looking like. Feels good. All platinum blonde, which I absolutely love. And yeah, I'm not gonna get into more about like the pre-plucked, pre-bleached, all that good fun stuff until I do it in a separate video. But I did get another wig. I bought a lot of wigs from Amazon. So you're gonna be seeing a few other unboxings of Amazon wigs. Again, not something that's easy to get here in Belize. So you gotta do what you gotta do, right ladies? Um, the second wig comes with another wig cap. It comes with a nice melting band. It also comes with another piece of elastic. I'm not liking that. 
because it looks like I might have to do some sewing, but we'll see. I digress. This is the 100% human hair lace front wigs. Any questions, please contact us freely. 13 by four lace front wig, 28 inches. All right, it does not say who it's made by, but of course I'm putting that up on the screen for you. And this is another, uh, the whole point of me getting these was because I wanted the glueless wigs. That was the whole point of it. And all these said that they were glueless. So this is what the other one looks like. It's a 26 incher. And again, I will do a separate video to really dive into the lace and the plucking and the pre-bleaching and all that when I do an install on it. It feels nice, it feels very soft. I'll have to let you know again about shedding and all that good fun stuff. So two new wigs, one blonde, one dark brown or almost black. That was it for the beauty items. Now I'm moving on to the electronics. And if you didn't know, I have been really focusing on my YouTube channel and good equipment is part of that in order for me to create better videos. So I have been slowly but surely purchasing little things here and there in order to create better videos. And if you haven't heard, I've been really complaining about the lights that I got. I finally figured out that I was raising the lights way too high. That's one of the problems that I was having. I wasn't having them right at face level. They were way above my head. So of course they're not going to give me great lighting. So in this video, for example, I have lowered the lights and I do feel like the lighting is a lot better, but I still wanted to get better lights. So that's what I got and that's the next item. It might be a little bit difficult for me to pull out every little thing, but I'm gonna try to unbox it as best as I can. Uh, it's in this enormous box. And of course this box got the most bird poop on it <laughs> of all. Now again, because I did have to open these up in customs, this was opened up. So I'm just gonna try to pull out the pieces. All right, oops. UB Size, which is the name of the brand that is who makes this particular light. It does come with an enormous carrying case. Wow, this thing is huge. This is the lighting. You know, it's one of those big umbrella lights. So I'm gonna have to figure out, it's one of those big, huge box lights. So I will have to figure out how it works and you will know in my next video if the lighting is amazingly better, right? And there's two of them. I'm not going to pull out the second one. Just know that it's a, a pack of two of the lights. And hopefully these are the bulbs. There's the bulbs. And they came intact all the way from the States to Belize. Very happy about that. And then these are probably the tripods. And again, there are two bulbs because it's a set of two. And yeah, this is the tripod and it, you know, I love the fact that it comes with that big carrying case that you can, you know, take your lighting with you if you need to. Yeah, really good tripod, really substantial feeling. It's a, uh, yeah, oh wow. That's, that's a tripod. Now that's a really sturdy feeling tripod. So excited about new lighting. I can't wait because it's just going to make my makeup videos that much better. So happy about that. One more item for the box lights. These are the actual covers that go over the box light that gives it that soft filter effect. So I just wanted to show you what those look like. So yeah, so this will go over the light so that you'll get a nice soft effect on the box light. So. That's what the back looks like. And they're just a really fine, they're almost like silk. I mean, I'm sure it's a nylon, but very soft, very lovely. Really happy that I've got lighting, better lighting. One final thing I should mention about the light box is that it has this type of a converter, like this. 
So you will need to get a converter in order to plug these in. I thought I had one since I am living here in Belize. I have bought a bunch of converters. I'm gonna have to go and try to find them, but I don't recall them having this type of a converter. So now I'm gonna have to hunt all over Belize to try to find some way to plug in my new lights. Ah, oh, annoying. Also in the interest of having better lighting is a new ring light. My ring light I've had for a long time and it's, coming to its end and I, it wasn't that expensive to begin with not that this one was all that much more expensive but it's just a little bit better quality and what I love about it is it's actually on a bracket lamp so this is by Rose I believe that it's called of course I'm putting it up on the screen for you but this is a 10 inch cantilever bracket lamp that has a ring light to it so as you can see you got your ring light and you can put your camera in there. And it's going to be perfect to actually be able to clamp it right to my desk and have just one more, just a ring light, you know, a really good ring light. I think that the box lights are gonna be more for my fashion videos. And depending upon how bright this light is, this will probably be my for my makeup videos. This is the way it comes, just like that instructions always and here is the actual ring light comes with a usb cord take it out of the plastic here so you can get a really good look at it that's a good ring light that's a good ring light um what is really funky with my old ring light is i did not like the part where the phone attaches to it wasn't a big fan of that because it sort of gets stuck in between the two lights if you have a really long phone, which I do. And it comes with the cantilever part for you to attach it to. It's a little stiff, but that's gonna be great. It, it's got some really good functionality to it and I probably have to loosen this up, yeah. Yeah, probably have to loosen some things up in order to make it work perfectly. Oh, this is the actual part that attaches to your desk or table or wherever you're going to clamp it to. Looks like that. And, oh, some other phone bracket. This looks like a, a, a different phone bracket. All right, so yeah, another little phone clasp. Ow, pinch myself. And, oh, and a remote. Oh, that's great. Yeah, it's a Bluetooth remote. So that's awesome. So new ring light. I told you, I, this is gonna be the year that my videos are going to be chef's kiss, I swear. So that's one of many things. I actually have another thing coming because I have a whole other Amazon order coming and that I'm really excited about. And I was hoping it was gonna be in this shipment, but it isn't. It'll be in the next one, which will be coming soon. This is the final item of the unboxing. And this is an item that I have been teasing my son about for a while since I ordered it. I wouldn't tell him what it is. He has no idea. And he's been actually sitting off camera watching me film this unboxing just so that he could see this item right here. I got, this is by Pioneer Profession, is a drone. And I actually have a really funny story about it. When I was at the port and I was going through customs and getting all of my items, you know, they have to go down the list of what it is that you purchase so that they can monetize how much the customs fees are going to cost. And so the guy was like, do you have a drone in there? I was like, yeah. So he like takes it and he like walks off with it and starts talking to somebody else. And I was like, I don't know what that's about. So I kind of walked over there cause they looked like they were trying to bust open my box and I'm kind of weird about that. I like storing things back in the box that they come in. So I went over there and so he was like, oh, okay, yeah, it's fine. It's, you know, and he just kind of waved the guy off. So the guy walked back over to where my boxes were and he was like, just so you know, these are not available to be shipped into Belize. You need a permit 
from the government in order to ship a drone into Belize. Like he was like, you need a couple of different permits in order to use a drone. And I guess they saw that it was such a small one that it didn't matter. I don't know. There's like, like you need a permit from the aeronautics and like something from, so I was like, wow, that's a lot. <laughs> that I, he was like, it's fine, but in case you ever, you know, decide to ship it. And I was like, okay, well, I'm hoping that I'm only going to need this one. So hopefully I won't have to have that, you know, go through that again, but next time I will know. So if you didn't know, if you want to get a drone into Belize, you need permits. So it comes in this little case. That's cute. Isn't it small? It's so small. And I did, of course, as I always do with all of my Amazon orders, I did a lot of research, read a lot of reviews about it. And listen, I don't know what all the parts are. I haven't put it together. So I'm really just going to be pulling things out and going, this is here <laughs> but i have no idea what any of this is um it does come with a three pack of batteries double a batteries which is great and it has this little pack here and so i have no idea what this little part is but of course i'm gonna read all the instructions to figure it out then it's got all these other little i guess these are like blades so it looks like i'm gonna have to kind of put some items together a little bit it does have a USB, and these look like little propellers. And then we have another one of these. So there's two of them, maybe these are the batteries. I don't know, we'll figure it out. Then I have, this is the actual drone itself. It's very small, and I have very small hands. So just so you know, I, I do have very tiny hands, so it's literally that tiny and that's probably why he wasn't like you know it was all that serious and this isn't it wasn't terribly expensive because although i do want to make better videos this year i don't know how to use these <laughs> and i don't even know if it's going to enhance my videos at all so we're just gonna have to see and uh Again, I will do a separate video testing it out, putting it together and you know, like sort of doing a first impression situation. One more part that I forgot. It looks like it comes with a little screwdriver to put everything together. I should definitely let you know that. And then um, this is actually uh, the controller piece here that has all the little dials of, you know, your little controller. And then you, I know that from, just from watching the videos as I was doing my reviews, um, this little guy pops up like this and this is where you put your phone so that you can, you know, watch what it is where the drone is going. So you can kind of do this with it, you know what I'm saying? And then, yeah, that's all the parts to it. Not anything, you know, earth shattering. Like I said, you know, I'm gonna have to figure out how all these things work this might be the landing gear oh i'm gonna literally have to read all of the instructions and it does come with the instructions to it as well um <clears throat> but i love that the that it's a carrying case so you can take it with you anywhere and use it you know and yeah i'm just gonna have to let you guys know how it goes um i'm really super excited about it my son is freaking out right now because he knows that more than likely he's going to get to fly the drone since I'm going to be the one doing the content. You know, know what I'm saying? Yeah, so I'm just going to, you know, figure out how all the parts work and we'll do a totally separate video on that. That was all the items that I have for this Amazon unboxing. As I mentioned before, I do have more items coming from Amazon. There was a whole kerfuffle with my shipping that was all totally my fault and I am going to be doing a separate video on that because it is really important if you are moving to Belize what it's like to be able to get Amazon packages here to Belize and now I have sort of tried two different shipping companies and in this particular order I actually happen to have some items shipped from one company, some items shipped from another, so that I could do a comparison of the two. This was from Hyde Shipping, and it did get here first, although the other Amazon order I placed a few days later. So that's why that 
order is coming a little bit later. But I'm really excited about that unboxing because there's also some really great beauty products in there, some new wigs, some more electronics, and yeah, just Amazon coming to Belize is really exciting. So that's it for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. If this was your first time here, I really do appreciate you watching all the way to the end. And I do hope that it will inspire you to subscribe to my channel. And I look forward to seeing you all in my next video. And until next time, you better believe it. Bye.